The ARM Skill Programme is all about focusing on closing the STEM skills gap. And we know to do that, we need to work closely with schools across the country on events such as the one today. This year, students have been asked to develop a boat that is designed to clean the oceans. It's really good because it allows students to think about their environmental responsibility and it allows them to think about programming and some of the key STEM elements. They're doing absolutely fantastic. I have to say, I'm blown away. And what's interesting to see as well this year, we've got a bit of involvement from outside computer science. So we've got a couple of DT support staff helping out with the actual structures, and they seem to be absolutely flourishing even more so this year. I think the use of uh, micro bits or, or similar technologies allows students to actually see practically what is happening when their programming works or doesn't work, and it helps build them as a future computer scientist. It's great to see such inventive ideas from the students. They've got their boats floating in the water. They're starting to put some of their motorised gear in there and it's just looking fantastic. This is all about a federated effort between schools, nationally and industry in the delivery of STEM education. And I think what we've got today with 19 schools brought together from across the north of the country, we can see the difference that it makes to the engagement the enthusiasm of the students and I think that's fantastic that we're able to play a part in that. The ARM School Programme have been fundamental in allowing this event to happen. They just give that foundation of which to let students flourish. So they give the, the initial uh, project, they give support resources for use in schools prior to the event to get the students prepared. Um, the equipment they provide on the day for students to use and experiment with is absolutely fantastic. Um, and without them, we wouldn't be able to do it. Thank you.